my, my father played polo, my stepmother played polo, my, my older brother played polo, so it's kind of, it's been a family thing ever since I, you know, been around. Um, I've always loved horses, the lifestyle, and I, I always knew I wanted to be, be a professional polo player ever since I was, you know, a little kid. I've been playing professionally since I was 12. Started playing riding when I was four and started playing when I was seven. The feeling of playing polo, the adrenaline, it's something that I can't really tell you. It's just a feeling, you know, for the, the, the time that you're out there, you forget about everything else and it's, a, it's like a two hour adrenaline rush, you know? It's, a very, it's very physical, it's tiring. Um, you don't have to run. But you, but you have to control the horse and, and put the horse in the right place and it's a lot of, um, it's a lot of signals from you to the horse and every, everything is happening while you're going at speed of up to 30, 35 miles an hour. You're riding a horse with one hand and you're hitting the ball with the mount and the other and Coordinating it all together is difficult. I mean, they're an animal, and they're gonna, they're gonna, and at the end, they're gonna do what they want to do. So, putting putting it all together is it's a little tricky, but I think that's kind of the, one of the appealing things to the sport. Well, the U.S. Open is the is the biggest tournament in the United States. It's the most prestigious, for sure. It is like the Super Bowl, and in the world, it's in, in the top three. I'd say the second biggest tournament to win.